Good Friday evening, Southeast Texas. Wow, what an awesome string of days we've got on the plate as far as beautiful weather across Southeast Texas. Tonight will be chilly up in the lakes area. I think we could get down into the lower 50s up that way under uh, clear skies tonight and into the mid to upper 50s across the triangle. We got uh, into the mid 50s area wide this morning and uh, easterly winds will turn more southeasterly tomorrow. So I think we could get into the uh, upper 70s and uh, lower 80s. Otherwise, just a fantastic Saturday afternoon in the upper levels. We'll be watching another trough of low pressure move through the uh, Midwest and that'll drag another cold front into our area as we work on into Sunday. Then we'll begin seeing a ridge of high pressure build over the plains and that means warmer temperatures. Also, we're going to be watching southwesterly winds in the upper levels of the atmosphere. That will likely turn anything that gets into the central Gulf of Mexico and keep it out of Texas. Otherwise, on the Gulf of Mexico tomorrow, looking at mostly smooth seas around a foot. An east wind at 5 to 10 knots, water temperature 74 degrees. Tonight, clear, maybe chilly in some spots. Otherwise, dry with low temperatures dropping into the lower 50s in the lakes to the mid to upper 50s in the triangle. Then tomorrow, beautiful weather, gorgeous weather with pleasantly warm high temperatures around 80 in the lakes to the lower 80s in the triangle. Extended forecast, it just goes on and on and on right on through the weekend with green bar days right on into Monday. After about Monday, we'll start to see a warming uh, trend and also a humidification trend, meaning higher humidities and warmer temperatures, but still over the next seven days, no significant rainfall expected with abundant sunshine, cool nights, and uh, warm afternoons. Uh, getting rather toasty, though, as we head towards the end of the next work week. Download our app, follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and as always, there's more weather at 12newsnow.com.